The man who helped to bring the Arnold Sports Festival to Columbus has died, but Jim Lorimer brought so much more to Central Ohio and the people here over his lifetime. Jim Lorimer put down roots in Central Ohio in the 1950s. I know when he first moved here to the Central Ohio area, he had looked around at different communities and somebody pointed out Worthington and he thought it looked like a really great place to be and not long after he started getting involved becoming Worthington's longest serving public servant, 52 years on city council as mayor and vice mayor. Ann Brown is communications director for the city of Worthington and worked closely with Lorimer. He was really just like a regular guy. I mean, he was very humble. He was very gracious and, and just really interested in everybody and what you had to say and how your family was doing and how your kids are and was also a bit of a sports enthusiast. He was always an athlete. He, from the stories he's told, he was captain of his football team in high school. Um, he always was dedicated to personal health and fitness and wellness, and that just carried over through his life. Lorimer was known for co-founding the Arnold Sports Festival. Arnold Schwarzenegger reacting to news of his death, saying Lorimer will live forever through the millions of people he inspired to join our fitness crusade and tune into this little niche sport called bodybuilding. But Brown says Lorimer cared about young and aspiring athletes in his own community. I never felt like it was all about him. He was all about other people. He has definitely left a lasting legacy here, impacted so many people, and just was a really great neighbor and friend. And in 2021, Worthington City Council named the fitness floor at the community center after Lorimer, cementing his legacy there. Jim Lorimer was 96 years old.